You can't escape what's in your mind. <sighs> What do you want with me? For you to gain your fullest potential, you're only holding back the true power of the SR. Isn't that what your father spent years discovering for? The SR was supposed to help humanity, not destroy it. You can't hold back from the true potential! I can sure as hell try. And with this whole multiverse plan all driving out there, Think about the possibilities. We could have our father back. My father, not yours. You can try to run, but you can't hide. We're finished here. You can't escape from the darker half! <laughs> Everything seems to be working fine. Yep, I'm all good. How about you, Susan? My glider's still destroyed from the apocalypse. It's gonna take me a while to finish it. Oh, man. Brandon, you all right? No! <clears throat> I, I mean, yes, I, I'm fine. Well, what you got there? Oh, it's just my glider. It's been busted up for a while ever since what happened at the apocalypse. If I can just get the engine running, then everything will work fine and I can just repair it. Hmm, let me give it a try. Let's see here. So if we can just reconnect the wires and then reset the engine, then it should kick on about right now. Whoa, how'd you do that? Well, I am something of a scientist myself. Thank you. All right, now I can get back to work. So, Mr. Dark Knight. Would you happen to know anything about the multiverse by any chance? The name is Brandon. And no, I don't know much about it. All I know is that it's something we should not be messing around with. If we make one big mistake, then consequences will show up. How would you know about that? What kind of consequences? There is a myth about the owner of the multiverse, Galactus. Galactus? The myth would state that he owns the multiverse. He keeps everything in check and everything in balance. If he sees one thing that's off in the multiverse and different universes, either two things will happen. One is that he would erase half of life in that universe, or two, he would destroy them completely. Wait, so if we traveled to the multiverse, then would it catch his attention? No one knows for sure. No one has ever seen Galactus before. Then what if we travel to the multiverse without him even noticing? What if we create a device that can not catch his attention, but still travel to different types of universes? We're only planning on traveling once, and that's it. That could be a possibility, but the chances are very low. But what if the chances weren't low? The chances are low! <gasps> Sorry, uh, I, I need some fresh air. What? was that? i never seen that before. I, I'd be careful if I were you. Now ah, you get it. Are you okay? <laughs> Sorry, didn't mean to scare you. <sighs> oh, it's just you. <sighs> you seem on edge. Are you okay? Yes, I'm fine, just... I don't feel like talking about it. Well, since we're kind of like partners, I think you should talk about it. Maybe I can help you. We don't talk about it! <sighs> Might as well. Before you two found me, I... I took this serum. My father made it a long time ago before he died. It was called Strength Revolution though we called it the SR. What does it do? It would give any person who would take it the enhance of strength, agility, speed, and also intelligence and reaction. But it has a dark side effect. It would make you lose your mind and lose control of yourself. 
It's too weird to the point where I can't even control my own body. It's like it takes over me. I would lose control of myself. Kinda like Green Goblin. Exactly like that, pretty much. Well, is there an antidote for the SR? No one ever made one. Not even my father. He didn't know that the SR would go out of hand when it came to the experiments and the testing. Why don't we make an antidote? That... that could be a possibility. But it would take months of practice and perfection to make it right. I will do what I can to get rid of this darker half of you. I appreciate your concern, but I am fine. Trust me. Look, normally I wouldn't say this, but... I would care about my own teammates and partners. Especially my little brother, even though he can piss me off from time to time. I care about him. And now, I care about you. I'm going to help you, Brandon. So, like, you're helping me as a friend? Yeah, like a friend. I thought I had a friend a couple of days ago. I don't know if I can let that happen again. Nah, your first friend was a good guy. But now you're one of us. Uh, fair point. Come back inside any time you want. Just think about it. You really gonna let her persuade you? I just about had enough of you. I won't let you take control of my consciousness and my mind. It's only a matter of time when I'll take over. And you won't expect on when it's coming. Then I'll be ready for it. And so will I. <laughs>